Hello friends, welcome to our YouTube channel Art of Testing. I am Rohit Agrawal and in this video we are going to learn about or talk about very fundamental topics in software testing. Now these words often conflict and confuse a software tester, not just the testers but the entire software engineering fraternity. So today we are going to discuss about the differences between bug, defect, error and failure. Now before we start, let me tell you that ISTQB, International Software Testing Qualifications Board uses bug and defect word interchangeably. They are considered synonyms in ISTQB. Bug cryogen is also referred to as defect cryogen rather or also bug life cycle is referred to as defect life cycle. However, having said that, the modern software testing fraternity draws a very thin line between bug and defect. So let's get started. Now let's start with the term defect. Now defect is something which is encountered by the developers. So every software development begins with some requirements. Now, when there is a difference in the software requirement and the actual functionality of the product, that is called a defect. Now, defect is something that the developer himself or herself identifies while writing the code or developing the product. Now, if a developer identifies that issue in the product and fixes it before it goes to the testing phase, it is called defect. The major difference to note here is that defect is a part of SDLC and in that it comes under the development phase. Now once the product is developed, it is given to software testers or QAs to test the functionality of the product. Now if the tester finds any differences in the functionality of the product, then what is expected, the tester locks it as a bug. So bug is identified by the tester. It is part of SDLC and STLC both. However, defect is only part of SDLC. Bug comes under the testing phase of SDLC and is a part of STLC. Now defect is not logged into the bug tracking tool or software. So if you are a software tester, you might be using the bug logging tool which could be Jira, Crack or a similar kind of tool. Now bug is logged into the system by a QA or a software tester and it is properly triaged. However, defect is not logged into the bug tracking system. So when you tell this difference in the interview process, you not only tell the interviewer that you are fully aware about the differences between these two terms bug and defect, you also indirectly tell the interviewer that you are fully aware about what is SDLC, STLC and their various phases. So from one question, you are actually telling the interviewer that you are well versed with SDLC as well as STLC. So let me repeat once again, defect is something which is an issue in the software functionality identified by the developer and fixed into the development phase. It is not logged into the bug tracking tool or software. Whereas a bug is an unexpected behavior by the software from the SRS document and it is identified by the tester during the testing phase. It is part of both SDLC and STLC and a bug is always tracked and logged in the bug tracking tool or software and later on it is also triaged. Now let's move towards the other two terms which are error and failure. So error is basically referred to some issues that causes the code to fail during the compile time or some issues in the system configuration side. Now this are the issues in the configuration of the system that makes the code fail or compile time errors in the software or the project or the code that does not let the code to compile. So these could be during the development phase itself when the developer is trying to 
compile the code and configure the system so as the code can actually run in the dev box or test box so in the development environment or in the software testers environment now when the product is fully tested it is certified by the queuing that the product can go into the production then the software is deployed to the client side remember the client side and when the client or the actual user of the software uses the product and in that case when the user identifies the issue or deviation in the functionality of the software then that is called failure so that failure is actually a deviation in the software functionality when it has reached the end customer the end users it is on the production system and is live now these could also be say for example if you have developed a website a website is operational on certain browsers and not functioning well on other browsers for example my hrs can say that the software should work seamlessly on firefox however there is no mention of google chrome or intel or internet explorer and a user somehow tries to access it so then in that case he or she will raise it as a failure however since it was not part of the actual srs this will fall under the improvement phase when a tester logs a bug he logs a bug as well as at the same time he can also log an improvement or an enhancement in the functionality of the product so this case would come under that improvement another example you would consider is that an ios application has been developed it is compatible on ios 12 but it might not be compatible on ios 13 so this is a failure on the production now there could be other scenarios as well like the performance issues that causes the product or the software to fail on production so for example if your performance testing has not been done properly and you suddenly have some say a great india festival or a big billion day where you have multiple hits coming out and at that point of time your system crashes it does not work out in that case that is also a failure i hope you were able to understand the differences between bug defect error and failure remember error happens due to the compilation issues or the configuration issues in the code it might not be the actual deviation in the requirement and the functionality of the software or system but the compile time or the configuration side of system failures which is causing the software not to run so that is called error error in the code error now let's talk about bug or defect now defect is something which is deviation in the functionality of the product or the software it is identified by the developer fixed during the development phase it is part of sdlc it is not part of stlc and it is not logged in a bug tracking tool or software whereas a bug is a deviation in the functionality of the product identified by the tester during the testing phase in sdlc it is part of stlc it is logged into the bug tracking tool or software and is triaged further failure is the failure of the software or product on the production system identified by the end user end customer and it causes the product not to function this could be due to performance issues compatibility issues or some unknowns which are not part of srs and later it becomes the improvements enhancements in the product i hope it was clear to you do let me know your views in the comment section below subscribe to our channel if you have not done already share among your friends and circle and do let us know your valuable feedback thank you and keep testing bye bye